What's up, you guys? Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. We are currently cooking up a storm in the kitchen because you know what? Hurricane Hannah is on the loose here in RGV and she is creating havoc. That's what she's doing. So you know what? I'm in the mood for some soup. That's right. While there's a hurricane outside, your girl is making some soup. Don't judge me. I started off with putting some hot water to boil and I boiled these garbanzo beans for about two minutes. I took it off the heat and I actually soaked it up all night long. And then I went ahead and woke up and afterwards I cooked it for another two and a half hours uh, on low on simmer because right here, as you can see, it's still a little hard. So it still needed some more cooking after that soak. So it says here, quick soak, rinse soft beans in large pot. To one pound of beans, about two cups, add six to eight cups of water. Bring to boil for two minutes. Remove from heat. Cover and let stand for one hour. Drain, soak water, and rinse beans. And that's the quick soak cooking instructions. So the overnight soak was to rinse and sort beans in large pot. To one pound of beans, about two cups, add six to eight cups of hot water. Let stand overnight or at least six to eight hours. That's what I did. Drain, soak water, and rinse beans. Cooking, cooking instructions. Put soaked and rinsed beans in three, four quart pot with six cups of hot water. Simmer gently with lid. Oh, it's not cooked yet, so it's just a soak. Oh, okay. Put soak and rinse beans in three, four quart pot with six cups of hot water. Simmer gently with lid tilted until tender, about one and a half and two hours. Oh, wow, this is a lot of effort. Next time I'm buying cans, gosh. So my mom used um, oil and brown sugar to cook some plantain, and this is the oil that I extracted from the plantain brown sugar she made. And you can just smell the sugar from the oil. I hope it doesn't affect the taste so much. But uh, I have here my salad master. I have it at 375 degrees Fahrenheit. Ooh, that smells so strong. I have the veggies marinating in each other's sauces, basically. So I'm just going to saute this. And I'm going to saute it for the next five to seven minutes. All right, it's been sauteing for a good eight minutes. It smells really good. So now it's time to put this into here, and let's go. Ooh, camera magic. And this goes. And it called for two cups of chicken soup, so what I'm gonna do is just put some water. That's what the cup says, too. And there you go. We're going to keep this cooking for a little while, put it to boil. Then once it boils for a little while, we're literally just going to put it in the blender, blend it up, and serve it. That's our garbanzo bean soup. Well, really, it's called a garbanzo garlic bean soup. I'm really happy with this purchase because on at Amazon, everything was like $17 to buy chia seeds or hemp seeds or flax seeds. So I went to HEB, looked around, and I was able to... I was able to find um, this for $5, chia, flax seeds, and hemp seeds all together. So I'm gonna add it to the soup to give it a little bit of fiber, some protein, and some omega-3s. <coughs> that looks amazing already. Doesn't hurt to have a little bit of fiber. Just trying to add more nutrients to my body and give my body some love, man. I can't not put paprika in my soups. I just can't. So, 
This is my first time following a recipe, but you know, you know, I gotta add a little bit of jasmine to it. Just a little bit of jasmine to it. I wonder if it's gonna be any good. Let's just blend it all together. Oh shoot, I'm gonna drop it. The blender is going to overheat, but I'm just kind of mixing it myself and putting it back in and mixing it myself. I don't know if I should put half and put some water. I know. I'm trying to decide because right now it looks like mashed potato. Bunch of this garbanzo mash in a little container for later. I put two of this of water of this much of the bean paste. And let's try it out. Hmm. I need salt and pepper. Let's put some pepper. Let's put some salt. Give it another try. Different spoon though, because we don't want to cross contaminate. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. That's really good. Wow, that made a difference. And that, my friends, is the amazing garbanzo garlic and bean soup. Or hummus. Just call it hummus with a little bit of water. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I'm honestly just so obsessed. This is my second serving because it's so good. It's so good for you. It's so high in protein and fiber and my goodness. This is just... Um, I can't believe it's not butter on the toast. Mm. Bon appetit. Oh my God. That's so good. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for watching me actually follow a recipe this time. See you in the next video. Bye. Don't stress. Make soup.